while you're editing and spending hours, you're not doing something a little more constructive, you're just tidying up. So I wanted to get you started editing really quickly. So I'm going to show you some really simple edits where you can just jump in. We're just going to cut up some clips. We're going to piece them back together again and uh, give you a little experience of just how easy it is and how fast it is to edit what you're doing. So I'm using DaVinci Resolve 17. Uh, a totally free software and if you're going to be creating maybe it's YouTube clips maybe it's TikTok maybe it's reels you don't want to spend all your time doing it you just want to get in get out get it done so let's go into to DaVinci Resolve I'm sharing my screen so I need to go into the DaVinci Resolve which means I won't be able to see you for a while but uh, if you've got any questions pop them do pop them in the comments now here we go we've got uh, a totally blank DaVinci Resolve, just called Nick Tutorial. So first thing I'm going to do is import uh, some media. And I just downloaded these uh, from Canva. Uh, just a little bit of cooking. And uh, I'll pull those in. So now you can see them. So if you remember, uh, we have the preview screens. There you go. And then we've got the timeline screens on the other side. So we're not going to preview them. Uh, what we can do is we can just let drag them all into the timeline. Uh, there's no audio on these clips either. Drag them in. <laughs> uh, just four clips. Um, they're all different lengths. And just pop them in the timeline. Running out of space there. Uh, so hey, actually, we've got this is a custom button timeline. You can click on that button. Now I'll have it all in the one, uh, one section. And now because we've, we don't need the media pool, we've got them all in, so we can take that off. And now we've got all that space to play with as well. So we've got all our clips. Now, as you can see, if you remember from yesterday, we've got this is our snapping tool. So we can snap the clips together. So I'm not going to overrun like that. So we can all snap them. Uh, that last little, oh, that's interesting, that last little clip has some audio, but that looks like it's completely dead audio. So I can delete that. Now, also, normally we link them. Now they're unlinked. Let's delete that, and we've got uh, nothing there. Okay, right, all we're gonna be using in this is our, our highlighter tool and our cutting tool. So that puts a little razor blade. So and we're not even gonna be using the preview. So here's our little timeline, so we can see the lady just doing some mixing, but that's quite a lot of mixing, so we don't want all of that. We've highlighted our blade, uh, so that's blade mode, and we can either just click with our mouse, um, or we can undo that. We can just do uh, Command B, and that will cut it as well. And so we don't want uh, this element here either, so we can just highlight it and go Ripple Delete, and that will bring the next clip to us or we can actually do it as a uh, let me undo that again we can actually do it as on our keyboard and on the Mac it is up uh, shift and delete so we highlight it shift and delete and that ripple deletes it so that just brings it all back together so we have no fancy damn transition here guys remember I said yesterday you can spot a, a, a new editor so again let's go on cutting tool uh, we only want a few seconds of her doing that. What's that? Four seconds, yeah, that's okay. So go back to highlight, highlight tool, ripple delete, and again, we're just gonna change it again. Very quickly, this is super, super easy, guys. Uh, so we can do Command B, yeah, highlight it. And that's when it gets really quick and easy. We just move it on our timeline. Uh, and we just got the keyboard shortcut, so uh, Command B to cut, up shift and delete, and that brings us back there. So now we've got a little eight minute clip. Uh, we might want to might want to make that a bit quicker. So that's what she what she's doing. She's mixing, 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 mixing. Cool. So that first one's way too long. Now. So we can either we can either just bring it up that way to trim it, uh, or we can just go in again on the timeline. Let's say that's our in point. So break that, and then we just ripple delete that. So shift delete, 
and there we go so now we've got just over six seconds this might be a little bit better they're all roughly the same size and that is how you do a really quick edit now if you're happy with all of that you can uh, uh, I've just made it custom to my thing so I can highlight them all and then I can lock them and then those clips are locked. So that is basically how we uh, how we lock, unlock, how we edit. Um, yeah, so that's how we do a very, very quick edit. Um, now, also, when you highlight, uh, when you hover over these, you can see we have on our timeline. We can let's put it on. So on our timeline, there's a transition. Now we can move, so we can pull in more of that clip. That's that way, because we cut it that way. So yeah, we can actually move that, so we can make that clip longer, and that will overlay uh, the other clip as well. So that's uh, another way of doing it. But uh, yeah, I would say just go with your selection mode. So Command A or Command B for your cutting tool, and uh, you're good to go. That'll uh, and that'll be it. And then we just do highlight what you don't want and ripple delete it all in. It is that simple. And so once you've got some more little clips, uh, you can you can add them in. Now, if you wanted, if you've got a long clip, let's make that one longer. Give it its full length. There's also another way you can do this. If I get the media pool. Um, and then we're not going to be clipping them, but we can actually add B-roll. So if we had uh, this as the B-roll, as an example, we could drag that on top, uh, and then we could just trim that down. So if we were saying this is one camera angle and we're going to move to another one, then back to our original camera angle, as an example, and play this. You can see what we're doing. We're just playing around. Uh, and uh, making it good. So this is just a quick editing tutorial um, with DaVinci Resolve.